Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life. And I wanted to bring you another cool indie game, something neat like we did last week with uh, the Jimi Hendrix case a week or two ago, whatever it is. Uh, and so I was scanning Game Jolt and Itch.io and I found there is a brand new one of these Cube Escape games. Now I've played a couple of these before. They're usually really well made uh, puzzle games like point and click but set inside a box. And the puzzles are usually pretty neat. The one that they did on French Impressionist Painters was neat. Uh, I think the company's called Rusty Lake, uh, which clearly, take a look at this, the lake is called Rusty Lake. Uh, and this one clearly has a couple of rooms. It has living room, upstairs, wheel, memories, river, and Rusty Lake. I think we can only start in the living room. So we're gonna do that. And um, I should say, guys, I am not good at these type of escape games. So the reason that I'm not streaming this and I'm making it into a YouTube video is because I have a pretty good feeling it's going to take me like an hour and a half. So I'm going to be recording and uh, hopefully by the end of me recording I have solved this but we shall see. Okay so here we are we've got whatever this thing is. Ah this is too easy. Catch it. Nope. Nope. What do you think I have to oh maybe I have to put this thing into the top of it? Well, why, why am I messing around with this? I don't even know what's here. There. That's a thing. So it stopped. Turn this wheel. Turn. Nope. Okay. We shall explore. Okay. That is locked. That is locked. There will be keys here somewhere. Some firewood. Cool. Okay. What do we got here? Some matches? Is that what that is? No, that's a key maker. That's one of those things where you put wax in there. They make matches. Yeah, there we go. I don't know why I thought that was matches. And it turned out there were matches on the table. Um, let's check in some drawers. What do you get in there? Nothing? What is that? Nothing? What's in here? Pan with water. Well, this seems pretty straightforward. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay. We now have a pan with hot water. What does that do? No. Okay. We shall continue to explore. What is this pot of boiling water going to do for me? Something must have to go in the water, right? Could I do anything with this key? No, I can't. Hot water isn't going to do anything with that, nor will matches. Oh! Locked. What are you? Key! There's a key back in there. I lit it on fire. Don't go away. Yes! Yes! Okay. Hi, key. No. Okay. Well, that would take me upstairs. Let's try it in the cabinet. Wait, wait, wait. Where am I going? Here we go. Okay, unlocked. Oh! There's an old woman in... Old Mother Hubbard? Did she live in a cupboard or go to a cupboard to get her poor dog a bone? What are you doing, Granny? Hello. These games are weird, I told ya. Gold to... Oh! Oh, there's a puzzle! Okay. Two, five, three. Two. I wonder what I'm supposed to be. So six. Let's start with six. And then we'll get a one. A two. No. A ten. How do you get a ten? With a six and a four. Which gives you a one. A two. A one. Oh, Lord, I have no idea. This is what I was worried about, fools. This is what I was worried about. Two. Two. Ah! Aha! Two, two. Five, five? Yes! Two. Two? Yes! One, one, 
Um, four, four. Oh shoot! How's this gonna add up? Um, I've only got ones and tens left down here, but I have a two threes, a two, and a six. There's no way to add these numbers together to get a ten. That's gonna add up to twelve, and so is that. Shoot! 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 Let's remember how this worked. Could I do three, two, one? I can. So there is a way to do this then. So I'm gonna try and get this 10 out of the way now by going 10, four, six. Right, okay, I'm onto this now. Get your big ones out of the way. Five for five. What's that? Uh, four for a three and a one. Two for a two. I think I might have this. Two for a two. A one, one for a two. A two for a one, one. Did I just solve something? Now, something should be coming out of her mouth or her. I should be getting a key or something. Like right now. Because what's this? Golden tooth. Oh, I got the golden tooth. Sorry, I thought that was the reset button. Okay, golden tooth it is. Uh, which we can now melt down uh, and turn into a golden key. No, we can't. Uh, okay. I got something. What if we put the pot on the stove? We'll put the gold tooth in the pot. No. Pot on the stove, we put the gold tooth in a drawer. No. No. Oh! I can put the gold tooth on the fire. Close it, open it up, and look what I got. What? Oh, I did! Oh, I got a big old blob of liquid gold! Sweet! Which means... Okay, now we go in here, and we put the thing, we put old Mother Hubbard's tooth right in there, close it up, look what we got. A golden key. Golden key, Mother Effos. You know what that opens up? That opens up the, the thing that is up here somewhere. I just need to find my way up. There we go! Gold key, gold lock, open that Mother Effa up, and we are in the attic. Cool. Let's have a sip of some coffee. Some lovely coffee. So we have a look around, we got this. Polly, what's up? You took a poop? You took a poop. We got a bird poop. You're out of poop. You're out of poop, you fool. Okay, so what do we got up here? We got nothing. We got windows? Oh. Oh, see this is what I mean with these games. They're kind of eerie. Like that's a creepy little image there. And we can't see out the other window because of the stupid uh, parrot. Here's a, here's a, uh, what do you call this? Spindle? Um, and a note. Dear Mr. Crow, remember the lake desires fresh memories. I will send you the body of a young woman later this month. Use the machine wisely. Extracting painful memories could cause corruption of the body. Yours sincerely, Mr. Owl. Okay, what do we got here? Scissors. And the soil is dry, but I put the bird poop on it. I didn't mean to. The soil is dry. Okay, we just need some hot water. Maybe get the hot water from the stove down there? Uh, on the stove, I said we might need this water. Can I put this out? Yes, we. what if we put that in there? Can I extinguish you? I want a pot of non-boiling water. Pan with water. It's not hot anymore. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now what? It should grow. It did grow. Hello, grass. Okay, scissors it is. Now we've got some grass. Body. Wow. See, these games are trippy. There's a cow. And, okay. Four symbols, those are clearly udders. We got, uh, what would you call that? It's like a stick with a triangle, a square, a butterfly, and a crosshair. Okay, look, that's the old lady from the cupboard. Okay, this is eat. look. Crosshair square, so that's four. What was the order? Yeah, so four, two, one, two, three, four. 
four two one two three four four two one two three four and I can do this four two one two three four dear mr. crow we corrupted the corrupted souls are still wandering the lake I might have found the one that can stop them if he can find the two cubes I will give you the storm you can bring him to the cabin sincerely mr. owl am I the one four two one here you go cow eat that damn stuff I put this under you the pans no longer full of water we go four two one two three four squirt me some milk yes okay good four two one two three four milk it is we have got a big old pot of milk okay so we've got some milk um how is the milk going to help us get in this grandfather clock hello and see a telephone okay so there's something i can do with a telephone we can also open here telescope sick that is not binoculars that is not binoculars what are you and some knitting needles okay there's a little tv Something scary is going to happen. Whoa. What did I tell you? It's a murdered woman with some 70s wallpaper. And that's the only station. So we are watching her now. Uh, okay, grandfather clock locked down here. Right, I'm going to have to set the time. Four two one two, three two. That's not a time. Uh, we'll have to find that out. Oh, hello, sir. Who have you decided to be? Hey, hello. Hello. You're calling me. Why are you calling me? Yes. Hello. Hello. This is Detective Dale Vandermeer. Yeah. Yes. Is this Rusty Lake? Yes. Fate. I'm sorry, your flesh is already hidden. So Dale Vandermeer wants to get into Rusty Lake, but his place is taken, and now there's a exsanguinated woman hanging upside down from a s Oh, guys! Why is this thing shaking now? And was that the chain that we had downstairs that lifted her up? I think it might have been. And that thing's shaking. Can I do anything with the TV? I can't. Have I even looked at all four walls of this stupid place? Yes, I have. Okay. Uh, I say we go back down and see what's going on with that chain. No, that chain is still in place. Okay. Has anything creepy happened down here? No, old lady. Oh! I can use it! Oh! Is there a time? 1384. 1384. How the hell does 1384 help us? That's not a time for a clock. Okay. I thought those were windows. This leads to the church. Or, or it, it points out that the clue is for the church. I didn't realize this was a keypad. Yes. Okay. 1384 it is. Unlock. Where do I go? Oh, shoot. Oh shoot, where am I now? That's a water wheel. 610. 610 is the time. Okay, cool. 610. Oh! I can move the body? I can move the body. And 
then I'm going to have to use that machine to pick it up, right? This is creepy. So I've put her in the machine. I now have to make the machine run. Wow, what a weird game. Old Mother Hubbard, you know anything about this, you old broad? I didn't think so. And that is a staircase, and that is a mother effing duck. Where? Oh, it's flooded down here. What are you? Okay. Um, should I stop this at a certain point? Let's go have a look at our duck friend. Oh, oh. Is he supposed to eat that stuff? Probably not. Cause I, can I undo this? I can't undo. Oh, I can undo it. So the water starts going back down. Yes, eat that. Okay. Okay. I think. Okay. God damn it. Go duck. Go. Go, your mother effing duck bastard. Eat that. Okay, he's fatter. We gotta raise the water level once, once, henceforth. One more time. Eat that. Right now. Eat it. We got a fat duck. What did I get? A fat duck! <laughs> what the hell's a fat duck gonna do? And what do you do? Wow, I still am stumped. I feel like I'm constantly stumped. Let's go upstairs, see if we can find a use for any of our items. Fat duck could go in the stove. It definitely could. So you're still on. Pan with water goes here. Fat duck goes in it? No. Fat duck could go in the oven, no. Yes, he could. Close that door, open that up. What do we got? We got a little roast duck. Too hot, too hot. Use the knitting needles to get it. Use the use the scissors to just let's look at it from a distance. I cannot figure out how to get that turkey out, guys. So we are gonna try to interact things with things. This game doesn't hold your hand. It uh, kind of just sits back and lets you figure it out. And it's not always obvious until you experiment. Shoot! Why am I just thinking about old lady knitting needles now? Shoot! Dump a pot of water on your head. Catch ya. What? I got old lady hair. Give her her own hair? No. Maybe I need to make, maybe I need to make some, uh, what's it called? Some yarn for her to knit with. It is a thing. Okay. Okay. Yes. 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 I now have some hair yarn. Wool. That is the word. Okay. Okay. Things with things. Just keep interacting things with things and you will figure it out. Uh, down. Old lady, now you can knit this, you old broad, you old bat. Knit for me. Warm, warm milk. Okay. You need warm milk. Oh, you are so demanding. Okay. Hot milk. You want warm milk. Oh! I was trying to cool it down a little bit. Hot and warm mean the same thing. Now you knit for me, you old broad. You old bat. Thank you. Oven mitt. Brilliant. 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 I got old of glove. Take you, take you. Now we got some grilled duck. That is not grilled. That is roasted. What the hell do we do with grilled duck? How is grilled duck gonna help the situation? Mm. Oh! You no, know, you want some grilled. This old Mother Hubbard, she won't even get her poor dog a bone yet. She's drinking all my warm milk and she is just devouring this delicious roast duck. What are you gonna knit for me now? It better be freaking magical. What is that? What is that? A net? A net? For the fish. Okay. Right. See, this is what I mean, guys. Once you figure it out, you start... I mean, it's not obvious that an old lady would knit a net. You have to... It's trial and error, for sure. You can't just look at this and know exactly what to do. Like I said, it does not hold your hand. Now, we gotta figure out how to cook a fish. So let me guess. Old lady wants some fish? Grilled fish. Yeah, I thought so. You go in here. 
close that, open that, take the grilled fish, too hot, of glove, take the grilled fish, close the door, go give this old lady, what old damn mother hubbard, eh? Mm. Grilled fish, yeah, I'm giving you grilled fish, yeah, eat that whole thing, you are a greedy old woman, knit me something amazing. If that's a scarf, I'm a slappy silly, rope, strong rope, strong rope, strong rope, uh, strong rope. What do we do with strong rope? Let's go all the way up to the attic. Guys, let's see if... What do we have here? There! He's... What has happened? Cube. That's... Okay, so we need to find two cubes. It's a white cube and a black cube. Green screen. Oh, it's off. So there's a white cube and a black cube. We need to find them. Oh! There's a new thing. What are you? W was that there the whole time? No. It's the man from the TV. <laughs> Mr. Owl. What the hell is going on? He's crucifixed. There's a lot of noise happening behind me. Oh, it's moving! The wind and the rain have made the windmill move. It doesn't have anything. Oh, it does! I've powered the machine. I'm scanning her brain. Oh, shoot, guys. Okay. We've got a pure brain scan going on here. And there are numbers. I don't know these numbers. Yes, okay. I thought I might be missing something. No? Oh, I just gotta pair things up. Easy peasy, I got it, don't worry. Shoot. I got it. Ba-boom. Give me three digits. A white cube. The white cube maybe goes in the machine in the basement. Does it? Is that what the, there's the arrow on the top? Is it an arrow and a cube? It is a cube arrow. Okay, one cube is through. It is dissolved, and I have done a thing. Look out the window. Two five seven sick sick sick. Okay. Oh, I can't believe I'm figuring this out, guys. Two five. Mother effing seven. And that goes in here. Oh, no. Another matching game. Easy peasy. Let's do this thing, okay? Come on. I got it. I got it right now. I got it right now. I think I do. Oh, yes I do. Okay. Done. Those are some creepy images. Those are some very creepy images, but that's what this game does to you. Give me a black cube. I got a black cube. Guys, we might be done. Oh, God. We've sucked all the soul out of her. Oh, this game is creepy as hell. I got the cube. I got your damn cube. Now stop killing people. I'm putting your cube in the thing. Game over. It's all... It's nighttime? I may have drawn too much evil out of the machine. Things have gotten freaky. Things have gotten freaky. What's going on upstairs? Old woman is dead. She's been murdered. I think she might have taken a knitting needle to the eye. The, the body is completely gone. I am hesitant to look upstairs. The cow's head has been removed. I'm pretty sure that's not what it- oh, what's gonna come out? Four, two, one, two, three, four. Okay, thank god it's just milk. I thought it was gonna be blood. A TV? No. No. Phone? Hello?
what's left? The cow's head. And a window I can look endlessly out of. The parrot's gone. The parrot is gone, for sure. Okay! There's the parrot, and there's something very, very evil. Uh, oven mitt? No. I will not leave. If you hurt that parrot, my friend, I am gonna stab you in the eye. Your memories belong to the lake now. I'ma just keep clicking. I'ma just keep clicking all that you touch, you change. Drop it. Drop it. I'll catch it. We freed it. We freed the parrot. That's it. Okay, guys. Well, as you can see, this has been a very odd little escape game. Took me over an hour to play. That's how dumb I am when it comes to games like this. But um, these guys have made some very cool uh, little uh, cube escape games. You can see a bunch of them here. I've played this one, Arl, and that is the uh, gave me the motivation to play the, uh, the this one. Um, if you guys liked it, I will happily go back and check out some of the others. But this is the newest. This is Cube Escape the Mill, and it's from Rusty Lake Games. Uh, I will give you a link in the description if you want to play it, although you'll have seen me beat it, so I imagine it'll be quite easy for you. Um, and that's it, geeks. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed, that really helps me out. And I will see you, geeks, in my next video. If you ever want to be an action hero in your life, this game is as close as you will come. Look at what's happening on screen right now. Rico, throwing dudes from planes. And look at just the way they've shot this. This feels like a movie, it doesn't feel like a game.